Hey guys, I'm doing a haul. Got a lot of stuff. When I went thrifting, it's all of it right here. I'm sweating already. Pause. Put my hair back. All right. I'm gonna try to go in like order of thrift store, but it's a lot, and I'm gonna be trying it on as I go. This was the best thrifting experience I've ever had. I feel like a lot of times I just grab stuff that I think is like cute, but it's not actually my style. So before I went thrifting, I went on Pinterest on so my style board. I just went through like all the pictures I saved and tried to find stuff that pieces that were like reoccurring that I thought were really cute and that would work in my wardrobe. Does that make sense? And then I made a list in my notes app of everything that I was looking for. Like black mini skirts, knit cardigans. The first store I went to was this place called Hope Thrift Store or something like that. It was really cheap. It was like the cheapest one of the cheapest places. I got this sweater. It's by the brand Izod. Izod. And it's just a gray hat quarter zip sweater. It was $2. And I washed all this stuff like multiple times. Some of it still smells kind of weird. I don't know if that's normal. The sleeves are kind of like a weird length, but I thought it was cute. You know, it could be layered like a over a dress or something could be cute. Second thing and last thing I got at that thrift store is this flannel. I promised myself I wasn't gonna get any flannels, but it was there, you know? Not that I don't like flannels, I just tend to like not wear them as much. But I like the color of this one. It's like a blue, green. Oh, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. It could look cute, but am, am I a flannel person? I don't really think I am anymore. I went thrifting with my family. Mom said she would take this, but I didn't want it, so I need to decide. Then we went to Goodwill, the regular Goodwill store. I feel like everything was like kind of overpriced. I don't know. Everything was like $6.99. Some things it's like, okay, that's not that bad of a price, but then some things it was like, mm. I found a pair of shorts there. The whole like butt crack was like ripped out and it was still $6.99. But I will say, I don't even know what I will say. What were they saying? Next I got this hoodie. This is one of my favorite, thing, my favorite things I got. I wore this the other day at Disney. So cute. So soft. Just says California on it. Oh, it's so cute. And it's like the perfect size. I tend to like buy stuff super oversized because I don't like tight stuff and it makes my body more visible and I just don't really like it. But this is like the perfect size hoodie for me and I just like it. I love the colors of this so much. It's just so cute. Bro, I ate eggs earlier. There's so much salt on them. I just feel like a balloon. I just feel tight in my skin, like my skin feels tight. I got this zip up hoodie that's like a nice blue color and it says Universal Studios on it. And I thought it was so cute, a little zip up. A lot of times I'm looking through the rack, I'll like look for colors too that I really like that just draw my eye, it makes it faster. Next thing I got is this shirt. This was very questionable for me. This one was one of the cheaper things, it was like $3.99 I think. <laughs> it's like a graphic of like a piece of paper and then it has these little drawings of these girls on it and they, they're like saying things. It says, I look so good, you guys need boyfriends, let's get yogurt. If it's not pink, why buy it? I have a crush on every boy. How about some pan Asian cuisine? Cause anyone seen my turtle? It's so stupid. I don't know why I got this, it's so dumb. It was really the how about some pan Asian cuisine that got me. I don't need this. Will I wear it? Possibly. Ugh, I don't have an explanation. I should probably crop it more because it kind of is too long. Oh, a cute little top that says weird things on it. Yay, this is so tight. Ugh. The next three things. This is the outfit I wore. That's so fucking cute. All right, we're gonna start with the skirt. This was one of the main things on my list of things I wanted to get. It's super small, so it's like kind of really tight, but it's like around my waist, not around. If it was around my, if it was around here, wouldn't fit. It's tight, but it is fucking cute. I'm obsessed with it. Also, it has pockets. It's kind of wrinkly right now, but we're just gonna go with that because I'm not gonna fix it right now. Just wait. So cute. I literally tried this on and was instantly like, yes, 100%. It has pockets. This is definitely in my top favorite things that I got. Next, also one of my favorite things that I got. Another thing that I suggest when thrifting is like, don't only look in your size if you can try things on. There's so many things that I got that were like smaller than my size or bigger than my size that fit me perfectly, but the sizing is just weird. So this is an extra small and like, I'm never an extra small. I'm normally like a medium in tops. The colors, I cropped it. I the rest of it right here. It was a little bit longer. I did in fact crop. Oh, this is so cute. It's so cute. It's like literally, oh, I love it. I got this cardigan, which I accidentally shrunk in the dryer because I didn't pay attention that it wasn't supposed to be dried and it's like cotton. So it's smaller than, than it 
was when I got it, but still very fucking cute. It's just like a chunky knit cream cardigan. So fucking cute. You're joking. $6.99 for this. It looks exactly like one of the pictures I, almost exactly like the, one of the pictures I saved on my Pinterest. It is a little smaller now since I shrunk it. And the colors, like this cream color is also in this shirt. Ah, moving on. These are the last two things I got from there. This one, I don't know how it's gonna, it's gonna be. It's just like a quarter sleeve, fuzzy, gray crop top. I could wear it with a bunch of different things. Let me try it on. Let me do that for you. I think it's cute. I don't know what, like even with the skirt, it's kind of cute. I to layer it. I don't know yet. I need to like see. It's soft, kind of cute, kind of weird. Last thing I got from the regular Goodwill store is this t-shirt just a teal-ish it's just a t-shirt that i figured i could wear to bed i wear t-shirts a lot when i'm just chilling why is the hole so small oh gosh bro what the fuck i'm crusty a little bit don't i just a t-shirt just a cute little t-shirt i went to the goodwill outlet store for the first time basically you go in there's a bunch of bins you don't know what it is dig through it it's by the pound so it's like a dollar 59 per pound it's just all the stuff that didn't sell i guess and it's basically a free for all <sighs> just breathe just fucking breathe <sighs> the first thing i got off is this it's just a green button up i really really like the color so much i've seen some people layer with this <coughs> and i thought it would be cute like to throw it over, to button up, like a dress. Is this really ugly? It looks like a lab coat. I'm sure that I could style it. I will try though. I got 10 things from here. I got 10 things. My family got 17 things and it was $27, so it came out to like a dollar a piece. Then I got this. I have no idea. I was just on try and get to try and get this on. This has no buttons, so I'm assuming that's why someone didn't want it. It's just a pink cardigan. Could be cute, just as like an open little. I think it's cute, I like the long arms we'll see it's a little open moment can you see all the lint on my shirt probably there's like lint flying around it's probably why i can't breathe let me take this skirt off in a sack it's tight next i got this uh, <clears throat> brooklyn new york coney island cropped shirt i don't know i don't really like cropped t-shirts and they're loose they just look weird on me but oh, why are all the holes to the head so fucking small i can't Oh my gosh. I could wear it like to the gym or something if I ever find myself there again or some type of physical activity. Next, I got this little, this is my first time trying most of this stuff on. I did try this on. I didn't try this on at the store, so I was like, I don't, I have no idea if this is gonna fit. It's like a little, it looks hot pink, but it's more like a muted, it's like a muted hot pink somehow. I don't even know what color it is actually. It's kind of like tight, but it's like a little stretchy, like it has stretch to it. I don't know. It it kind of just like looks really small. Next up is this shirt. It's super questionable. I have no idea how I'm gonna style this or wear this at all. It's like a little button up, red and white. I was just picking up stuff. I honestly got a lot of good stuff. This store was hard because you couldn't try anything on on, so it was just like you're just picking stuff. You're just grabbing. I like that it's sheer. Like it could be cute. I think it is. Is it cute? I have to like style it cute, I think. Oh, snilly. It kind of looks like ging gingham. Next, I got this old navy shirt. I know a lot of these things are questionable, but just think about it. Just have a little think about it. I got this shirt. It's orange and navy blue. I really like the like orange stitching on the blue. I just kind of, I kind of like it. I think it would probably look cuter if it was cropped. No. Maybe not. I think it's cute. This is a workout. I got this pink Rollins college tee. Another thing, like I just kind of grabbed it. I'll probably like, crop it a little bit. I just really like tight cropped shirts. Just a cute hot pink-ish t-shirt. Like that it's tight. I can wear it if I'm just living. So that's pretty cool. Next, I got this shirt. I'm gonna start picking up the pace because this is taking a while. Blue, navy blue. Nice little graphic. It says Minnesota, where the middle of nowhere is somewhere. Oh, and it has a big head hole. Thank you. Love a big head hole. Nice. This is a thing I shrunk, which is kind of sad. Because I was going to wear it. This one is shrunk. Like, it's to the point where I can't even wear it. It's like a kid's zip up now, for sure. Was definitely a lot bigger before I shrunk it. Can y'all relax? I will still try it on for you, just for the visual. It's just really, like... really stiff 
Like if I try to stretch it a lot, maybe. Is it worth it? I don't know, maybe I can wash it, have it like stretching. But it's not like that cute. Like it's kind of ugly. So I'm not that mad at it. Woo! Last but not least for the for this store, there's still more coming. I got this sweater, which I thought was very cute. For a fucking dollar, are you joking? It's so cute. I There's something I love about this, and I think it's cute with the skirt, like with some like leg warmers or something. And cute, are you joking? I did end up going thrifting again a few days after. This was That was gonna be it, but I went again with my family. They were just kind of like, hey, we're going, we'll pick you up. And I was like, I don't want to spend money, but <gasps> sure, if you're offering. So I went again to the same two stores that I just showed. We actually went to the outlet one first, and then we went to the regular Goodwill. So I'm going to show you the outlet one first. And I got these are hangers because I paid attention this time. Stop. I paid attention this time, and I didn't put all this in the dryer, so... None of it shrunk, thankfully. All right, the first thing that I got is this Howbots vest. I literally picked this up and, oh my gosh. I don't even care what anyone says. This is so fucking cute. This is the cutest thing. Oh my gosh, I love it. I, like, what, how did this not get, how did not, how did no one buy this in the regular Goodwill store? I don't know if that's how it works, but if it is, how did no one buy this? Dude, it's so fucking cute. I don't care if I look like a grandma. This is so fucking cute. What? It was a dollar? Well, I got, I think I got four things. It was five dollars, so it was like a little over a dollar. We went like earlier this time, we went at like two or three. I think it was like three o'clock, and there were so many more people in there. I just lightly dug. Next thing I got, also fucking cute, and it's the same vibe. I don't know who or what or where, but this is just, it's just me. This is from Croft and Borrowed. It's very heavy, but like it was just sitting there. It's got this like cute ass pattern on the not pattern. Cute ass shit on the front. It's got bells. It's definitely more of like a Christmassy sweater vibe. But imagine me fucking sipping some hot cocoa in this sweater. During Christmas, it was a little it feels a little nasty. Not nasty, but the just the material inside just feels like rough, like scratchy. It's got the snowflakes in the back. Oh it's so cute though. Catch me, catch me at your Christmas party. I've never had a Christmas sweater before. Oh my god, it's so cute. Is my style like grandma? Next, I got this cardigan. I was unsure about this, but it's like very, very light. And it, it's just a green cardigan. I don't know how I feel about grandma. It kind of makes me look like a mom or like a business, like a the older person. I don't think I like it. I don't think I know. I never know, do I? We'll see if I, if I will ever wear it. Last thing I got at the outlet store is this little child's shirt. It says, run, Forest Run, Minnesota. Did I get two Minnesota shirts? Yeah, what the fuck? This says Minnesota too, what? Is that a sign? Should I go visit Minnesota? It just has some animals on it. You know, I really don't want to try this on. Cause the hole's gonna be very tiny for my head, but I'm doing it for you. I just want you to know. This is all for you. Oh my gosh. Mm, I think that was the tiniest one. I have a lot of shirts like this that I stole from the child section. Is that bad? Probably. This was in the bins. It was in the bins. So it doesn't really matter. Cute little baby tea. When they say baby tea, they mean baby tea. Cause I stole it from the child section. All right, then lastly, three things left. Finally, we went to the Goodwill store, like the regular Goodwill store. I got this Izod crew neck, cute, comfortable, soft. This was like $4, it was cheaper than like all the rest of the stuff that I've gotten. Not all of it, but most of it. Just a nice crew neck. Love a crew neck. It's been hella fucking cold here. And all this stuff I thrifted is really coming in handy because I can finally wear it. I got this scarf, it's a gap scarf, which is cool. It's just a green scarf moment. They had one that was like pink and purple striped and it reminded me of Hannah Montana because it was like one of those thin ones. Didn't get it, but I thought it was cute. I liked the color. It's $1.99. Did I wash this? I did. I did. I did. Last but not least is a home item that is so fucking cute. I love it. I got this. I don't know what it's supposed to be for, but it's just like a little, it's just this and it's like iridescent. I love iridescent things. I don't know what it is about me, but I just love it. I'm thinking about putting like a plant in it or using it to hold something, I don't know yet, but it's so cute, look at it. It was $2.99, they had another one there, the same thing that I should've probably got, but I didn't want to, so I got one. That's all I got. It's a lot. Uh. <laughs> 
super excited for it all. I'm obsessed. I need to hang on with this up now. Hope you enjoyed. If you go thrifting, look at your Pinterest first. It really gets the vibes going. And it helps a lot. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. It's a shiny minute.